Hi, Get The Gloss, I'm Marissa Montgomery and I'm here with the lovely Tamara and we're gonna find out what's inside her beauty bag. So your number one item. I think the number one item in this bag would have to be the Clinique CC Cream. I love it because it's in between a moisturizer and foundation. And does that have any SPF in it? How do you it feel does. about SPF? You know what, I never used to wear SPF, how bad. I used to like lay in the sun and fry and I've really learned my lesson. So whenever I go like anywhere warm or even if it's not that hot, I still like to have SPF in whatever I'm wearing. Second favorite product in the bag, number okay. two. I would say this is my second favorite product. It's my favorite ever lipstick. It's NARS. Do you and... apply it yourself or would you use a brush? No, no time for brushes. Just no time, just on. put it on. Are you an yeah. expert? Are you one of those people that can do it with your eyes closed? More or less by now, yes. What else is in the bag? So, dry shampoo, because I'm way too lazy to wash my oh, hair every day. So You've got to smell this, it smells like dessert. It smells delicious. So this is from my line, and I absolutely swear by it. This is your line, where can we buy your line? Um, you can buy it at Harrods, you can buy it at Harvey Nichols. Selfridges. This is just the most perfect size. I think it would fit in most kind of clutches or evening bags. And it's like a cute bottle, so you'd like want to whip it out and like show it off. Next. Next. Hairbrush. Tangle teaser. Everyone always says it looks like a dog brush, <laughs> which it does, but I love it. It does not pull my hair out and I just can't live without a brush. Next. Goodbye stretch marks. <laughs> ah, of course, because you're <laughs> expecting. I have been using this religiously. I've literally been like lubing up my whole body with this, hoping not to get stretch marks. And I have to say, so far so good. So I feel like this has really worked for me. Have you got an action plan for once you've had the baby, like getting back into shape? I think that as I say, I want to enjoy my time with the baby and not like just focus on losing weight. But obviously I'm going to be healthy and do some exercise because I think it makes you feel good as well as look good. It does. Next product. Mascara. I love this one. This is Charlotte Tilbury and I love it because it does give volume and it makes them long but not clumpy. Lip balm. Kiehl's coconut flavour. I think that like in my handbag I probably have like 50 lip glosses floating around. I think we're on our final item. Last product. Oh my gosh. Face moisturiser, mm -hmm. which I'm so particular about. I used to have such bad skin as a teenager and I used to refuse to moisturise my skin because I thought if I moisturise, it will give me more spots. Anyway, that's a complete myth. But this moisturiser doesn't have oil in it and it's still super moisturising, um, which I love. Do you have any tips that anyone's maybe given you? Um, just beauty tips that you can share with us? It sounds ridiculous, but honestly, I do think that sleep is really important. Water. Water. And I think like not too many heavy nights. I think it really shows, on, especially on a woman, if you've been partying too totally. hard. Totally. Brilliant. Thank you so much, Thank Tamara. Thank you. Awesome. Thanks. <laughs> It's been nice chatting, but bye for now, get the gloss.